So, dear student of the mysteries, are you a student of the quest? Who am I? And do you really, really want to know? Because you have to be very sincere here at this game. I'm not interested in a diluted truth. I'm interested in the complete truth. So it's those ardent warriors, both men and women, who feel to really sort out the differential between a slight truth and a complete truth. And this is where the sword comes in of Excalibur. The sword is blue, white, diamond, fire, vertical. We're not talking about an enemy. We're going to learn to seal the circle and cut away the drafts of the bygone era, the strands of our ancient memory and our limitation, and move on now. We're going to seal the field. So if you're a student, please hear my invitation to enter a new story. I'm going to call it the Emerald Grail Story. Emerald because it's going to be very healing and it's going to be of the heart. And because of the emerald records of Hermes Trismegistus, a thrice-born immortal, it'll contain information that'll cause you to remember your origin. And the grail, because the greatest of all quests is the grail. And you could have, well, what is the grail? And that's fine. Today I'll call it the fiery chalice of synthesis, a beckoning call to the mystery. What is the nature of a grail? Discover it inside yourself. In that you will find the flaming heart, the inspired heart, and I guarantee you will find art and creation. In the nature of the grail, you will find a direct lineage into art and creation and into a congregation of people devoted through ceremony, through intention, one-pointed, to sing, to dance in that pure intention so that we can build the field. As we build this field, this field goes out into the morphogenetic field. This is the new. Let's move beyond duality. Let's seal the field and build a new covenant. I call it the rainbow covenant because it belongs to Hugh Man. Hugh Man is seven colors, seven generations. Forms a symbolic code. It unites heaven, the unseen worlds, with earth, the visible worlds. And surely we, each one, is the rainbow covenant. We, our evolution, our evolution, our coming here, is the seal of the rainbow covenant. Sevenfold is that rainbow covenant. It goes from red in the beginning to orange to gold to emerald in the heart to blue to indigo to sapphire. It's the secret of seven chakras, seven whirling vortexes of fire and intention. And it belongs to seven dragons seven colors, and seven flames. It's a symbolic language, a metaphoric language, a language that bridges what we see between what we don't see. And it always has to be in myth and story. It has to go beyond the intellect, beyond the vision. It has to summon up a greater inspiration to aspire. If you are willing and able to assist this grail mystery template. The invitation now goes out. We're making a film and a documentary here in Avalon concerning the mysteries, and it's going to begin in Avalon as a quest concerning the emerald grail and the mysteries.
And I, as the Merlin, are going to conjure a spell through language and through truth. And if you choose to conjure it with me, we're going to conjure it together. And we're going to learn how the field works, how language carries the template of the sword and the power of this revelation forward. And we're going to educate ourselves to this field that is encoded in the great tree of unity that exists in the center of the world. And inside yourself is this divine template, this healing field. So we're going to learn to complete the loop, the last piece, serve the nature of the sacred self, turn away from the old world into the new. We're going to reverse the field. We're going to represent the future of where it's all going. We're going to call it in. And we're going to call in all the assistance of all the heavenly hierarchies, all the divine masters behind the veil, all the helpers, all the guides, all the ancestors, so that we can prevail. And we can move forward now. The old is over. The time of iniquity is over, I guarantee. These beings who have controlled the world's matrix on the third dimensional plane through fear are on their way out. It's a divine blueprint. And once you know how to protect the circle and heal the wound, then you'll be in a process of revelation. And this is where it all came from. Because Merlin showed me how it all works. So come, whoever you are, in truth, lay down your burden and heal the wound. In the male mysteries called the wound of the Fisher King, I'll call it the wound of the Fisher King and Queen, but they return to their eternal glory. It's a myth and a story, and you're invited. And if you choose to serve, this ministry of the great tree of unity. Come and meet me one, two, three hours a day. We will build the field of our sacred intention. Many things are in store, but we're just beginning. Some are in Avalon to begin. Emerald Grail story. For those called those ardent warriors of truth and light. A dragon story of nine dragons. Encoded in light and mystery and sound. Song and dance. Romance, the truth. A new myth and a new story. pronounced this day in Avalon, just to begin, to weigh your appetite, to savour the grey of wine.